Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Please welcome my guest at this time, the new GCA Global Champion, James Frost. We are in Canada tonight. You have finally returned home with the GCA Global Championship. How much did it mean to you when you won that title in the League of Champions main event? Yo, Mixter. Yeah, it feels great. I, I can't really describe it. I, I, I feel both blessed and vindicated. You know, back Christmas 2017, when Robert flew to Banff to come visit me and asked me to sign to his new upstart EFED that he was calling GCA, uh, this was the plan. This was always the plan, to be this company's top champion. And now, look at your boy. I'm sitting at the top of the mountain now as the GCA global champion. As you're probably aware, you also ended Red's pay-per-view winning streak. So my question is this, now you're done with Red, what's next for the clutch reformer here in GCA? Yeah, yeah, uh, I put a lot of thought into this actually, and uh, the old clutchster is open to any and all new challengers. There's a lot of guys in the back there that I haven't done any business with, and uh, I see a lot of money to be made against some of these young studs. For way too long this title's been tarnished, and it's my plan to bring this back up to where it needs to be, to put this championship on a pedestal like I said before, and yeah, have this to be the most talked about title, not just in GCA, but have it be the most coveted title in the entire car community. Thanks, Jet. You know what? Congratulations, Frost. Frost is so much Rex. Is that what you wanted? Mr. I always have a good match? I'm sorry, but I'm, I don't think I have to reintroduce myself for everybody, but I will. My name is Jaden Shadow. Get that right. It's Jaden F. and Shadow, and I'm going to be PG for a second because clearly that's all you're worth. <laughs> Let's be dead honest to your false. You're a liar. You're a false prophet. You, my friend. Well... Not my friend, but you, Frost, are a failure. You have what I want, and I'm coming for a prick. And I'm not sorry that all of GCA has to watch you every single week. No, I'm sick of the idea that everybody believes in the back that you're the best because in all reality, you're not the best. I'm the best. I've been the best since day one and nobody has been able to tell me otherwise. Silo Jordan survived me. Every single person that's been in the ring with me has survived me. Professor Buzzard can buzz off. You have something I and I'm not stopping until I give it. Jaden, Buds, are you done with your what about me, what about Raven speech? Because, Bud, you're right. You are great in the ring. You are a freaking ring general. You're one of the best in this community. But you want to know why you're always overlooked here? It's because everybody tunes you out, man. It's the same BS every time you post or open your mouth. The constant, love me. I'm awesome. I'm better than everyone BS. Man. And what, and okay. What's with all these posts and these polls that you post on Twitter all the time? Uh, what member of the shield do I remind you of the most? <laughs> buddy, shake your bloody head. You don't remind any of us of any of them. Actually, you know what? Do you know who you remind me of? In Canada, we have this cartoon. It's about this little French boy. He's a whiner, he's a complainer, constantly needs praise from his parents, constantly needs validation. His name's Caillou. That's who you remind me of, little Caillou. So Caillou, if you want this match, let's get out to the ring. Oh, Mickey. Stay frosty, buds. And pour out a little bit for those who ain't with us Ready, ready, I don't get ready, I stay ready Cause the consequences is heavy My man D said he would never quit Even though the thing's heavy We push like a 7-7